Hello, in this video I've got a couple of visitors coming over to my workshop. A good friend of mine, Jonathan, and his daughter, Daisy. Daisy's going to be turning a leg uh, for a dog bed that they're making as a, as a gift. Um, we, had a, we had a lot of fun uh, doing this and uh, doing the filming and the turning. And, uh, and I hope you enjoy it too. Hello, this is Daisy and this is Daisy's Cornish Creations. <laughs> Just make sure you get your face here as well. Okay, what I want you to do is get a pencil and let me show you it spinning. Whatever you do, don't put your fingers anywhere down there. Because uh, that, that bit, that's bad. <laughs> and you so, won't be able to do any writing tomorrow, Daisy. It's <laughs> so when it's spinning, let me just, mark, let me just do those marks a little bit more. Do you understand why Andy's put marks on the wood? No. It's the different, it's where there's a scoop out there. So that's, that's between those two lines, mm -hmm. that scoop, and then that bit there, if you hold it up, that bit there is between those two lines, and then there's another scoop out to that line, and then that's the very bottom of the thing. Yeah, so it's all the different changes. So, so now you're going to mark you get the, the pencil, list. right, and when I start it spinning, mm -hmm. You see those lines? Yeah. Just you just get the pencil and rest it on there and just put it against those and let it do that on all of those lines. So just just hang on a second, let me get out of the picture. Okay, you do that. Yep. And that one. Great stuff. Right. Now then, this is the this is the interesting bit. Okay. What we're going to do first? Oh. <clears throat> it's this scoopy outy bit. So we're going to we're going to get this. Mm -hmm. Now then, are you too a little bit too close? Just, uh, I'm just going to pull you back a little bit. Okay. All right. Can you hold that? Now, are you left-handed or right-handed? No, right-handed. You're right-handed. So you want it like that. So you need to come a little bit more this way. <sighs> right. And the idea is, you've got to keep that flat down there. And you can hold it there, and you can hold hold it hold it up there with the other hand but just just make sure it's always flat down there keep it up a little bit and then when we spit when it starts spinning what we do is very gently just go into there but do it do it very slowly right then I'll just speed it up a little bit right put your put this this hand a little bit closer so that it's touching it's just touching the back of there and that's how you control how little, how much you put in. So just go in a little bit, nice and slow. A little bit more. Press a little bit more. Give it a little blow. That's it. And then, fine. Someone will say something. Will say, <laughs> you need some safety gear on. <laughs> okay, so let's have another go. That's it. Just push it forward. Keep holding it nice and tight. And then we bring it over. 
to that other line there. That's it. A little bit more. Yeah, that's it. Just push it in a little bit. Give it a blow. It's gone. That's gone. That's gone. <laughs> Take with your hands, Daisy. Yeah. Is it? <laughs> you can have all this free. <laughs> just, just keep that just out of the way. Just for twelve fire lighters. <laughs> let's just uh, let's just mark those. Right. Right then. The next bit. Let's have that one. Oh, is it steaming up? Oh dear. We'll use this one. And oh, let me get around there. if you want to hold that, same again, put one hand uh, nearer to the front there, and one hand there. Can you reach that okay? Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to go, we're going to go in a little bit uh, um, to make make that little flat. A little shoulder. What what that's supposed to do is it's supposed to be it comes along, it comes in. And probably in a little bit less than that, then flat, and then out, then flat, and then in again. So that's the kind of that's the kind of look that we're going for. So, so you've done to, that bit already, guys. You've done that scoop. Yeah. We need to go in there and there to make those little flats, and they've got to be lower than that. So they've got to be down here somewhere, <coughs> but we'll, you'll understand when we get there. Right then, let me, uh, so you keep it up there somewhere, hold on to it there. Right, don't touch the thing yet. Right, now just gently press it forward. Right. 
Right then, now we'll probably go down a bit further with that one. Um, so we'll back onto this one, hold it under there. Remember how you hold it, Dave? Where do you put your fingers? That's it, resting on that the back of there, Dave. Really close That's to there. It. That's it there. Okay, just keep it away for a second. That's it. Now just go a little bit forward there. That's it. Keep it up nice down and flat on there. That's it. Okay. can do the the rounded bit so that we're going to round that there and there and this one we need to come with this chisel and it's a little bit awkward <coughs> we have to hold mm -hmm. it just up a little bit and we we go in and then we turn it to one side slightly so you move it round so, so, so put your hand a bit further down here that's it so keep it away from the while we start, away from the piece, and then just go towards it, right, and then this way, a bit further, a bit more, right, and then just bring it across that way a little bit, a little bit further this way, a little bit more. Right, and this time we're going to go the other way and we're going to turn it out that way a little bit. So, a little bit, a little bit there, it, out a bit further. Looking good, Dave. Well done. Is it looking good? Yeah. And we'll go with this one. And what we do, we don't want that sharp edge there, so we're going to try and just round that last little bit off a little bit. And, and this should do that. You see, it's a different shape. So rest it down there. Hold it the same way as before. That's it. Spot on. Keep it away from the piece for a second. Okay. All right then. And we're just using that edge there. Just using it on that little bit there. So just gently go forward. And it in. And it back a little bit. Push in a little bit more. And swing that side around. Okay. And it. Just come back and swing it towards your touch. Do the same on this side. So we just go into that edge. Swing it just away a little bit. Back the other way. 
bit we actually want to take a lot of this a lot of this material away so what we'll do you is can see it's getting thinner now isn't it, it gets a lot yeah, shorter it gets really thin so yes, we've, got, we've, got to go, we've actually got to go below that so should we use this big beast mm, of a thing whoa <laughs> this is whoa. huge you'll have to just jump off a second I have to stand in the other room to operate this one, days. <laughs> so we'll just have to bring that back a little bit. Uh, do you want to jump up there and we'll see how close you are? If you grab that, put it under your arm, and then put that on there. Yeah, that's not too bad. Right, and you can still put your hand up here. It's big, but it's, it's not as frightening as it looks, okay? But we're going to take off a lot of material now. So it's going to go crazy, is it? <laughs> okay. Right. Are you ready? Right, gently push it in. Move it that way. Oh, That's it, a bit more. <laughs> you know, like a little hamster covered in sawdust. Right, if you want to brush some of that off yourself. <laughs> That's a bit of a beast there. It is, very heavy. Yeah, it's a <laughs> Right then, so that wants to be about there. And then, uh, then we go down to... Where is it? do now we'll go back to this one and we just want to make this nice and neat at uh, both of these so we're just gonna we're just gonna tidy them up a bit put that under your arm one hand hang on get that clean a little bit that's it a little bit close to the end that's it raise that up a little, little bit that's it right right gently go So we're going to do the same, we're doing the same scoopy thing again. So it's not that one, it's that one. So 
if you grab that, put it under your arm. Yeah, and we're going to go from that mark, from that point there, and we're going to scoop it out to this point here. And it's quite, yeah, it's fairly deep. So it's quite a bit of scooping. Right then. Are you, oh, let's get you a bit closer because it's um, stretching a bit now. Hold it down, That's it. hold the chisel down. That's it. <clears throat> right, just lift it up slightly. That's it, let's start it up. That's it, make sure you keep your hand back here. I right, start there, just go in. Well, I'll tell you what, let's just hang on a second. Let me move the, uh, let me move the rest a little bit closer. It's the closer it is, the safer it is. on there again, raise it up slightly, just come to the side, that's it, and just come back a bit, start it up, right, start at this, this edge here, back again, and up to the line, that's it, and then back again, Is <laughs> it looking leggy days? Now we've got to turn that so it's a ball at the end. Like that. Yeah, except it goes all the way around to that point. Um, what shall we use? <coughs> we'll probably now we'll start off we'll start off with this one and then we'll start it turning and then we'll move on to the other one. You got that? Let me get there. Remember what you Some did with us. the ball? You moved round, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> so we start, yeah, we start, we start just there, get it nice and flat, and then as we go that way, we, we move that across, and then when we get to about there, we'll have to stop because it won't, you can't, you can't reach anymore. But we'll start, we'll start there. But keep it away from the piece at first. Ready? Right. A little bit higher there. That's it. Bring it round a little bit. Back again. Bring it down again. Then we go into into there. That's it. And then move across a bit more. Keep that end up a little bit. And go in again. Get push a bit harder. 
bring that out a little bit more. Push a little bit more. Right, bring it back across again. Right, okay, pull it away. That's good. Great. Right, we'll move on to the other chisel. <coughs> See what see if we can do it with this one. <coughs> right then. So this one, we'll start over here and we'll just we'll sort of just go in, but gently and after it starts turning. Okay? You ready? Right. Okay. Now move it, move it to there, that is that high point. Move it across this way. That's it. Go in again. Across a little bit more. Right, then. move it that way and go in again. Across again. We're only using that edge. We don't want to dig in too much, so we need to flatten it that way a little bit. So you go in there, yeah. That's it. And as we go across, swing it, swing it out. That's it. Get in there. I think I need to move you. To be able to get it to round. Jump down, Dyson. Just oh, go on there. Just watch that. Move it down. Point it down. Good. Right, just move you across a bit. Right, <coughs> right same position. Hold it nice and high. Just lower that down slightly. Right. So what we're going to do now is we're going to. We're going to go in there now, because we want to try and get right down there. So just hold it off a little bit. Are you ready? A little bit higher. That's it. Keep it nice and flat on there. That's it. Press it in. with the other chisel. Actually it could be a slightly flatter bottom I think because if it's at a point it'll, uh, it'll probably dig in won't it. So I think what we'll do is <clears throat> if we come in, in here with this one and we'll just go a bit with the other hand up there we we'll just go in about there and flatten the bottom a bit. Very nice and tight. pretty good. We just need to tidy up a bit because it's a little bit a bit of a ridge there. So we're doing it with this one and we're, st we're starting out here and then we're just going to bring it around and just try and flatten it off a bit.
one. <laughs> okay. All right. So I'll swing it right out there. Keep smiling, everyone on YouTube's watching you, Des. <laughs> right, then. just press it in. Right, come out this way. Yeah. You like that shape? Yeah. That's pretty cool. Cool, and you, you cut that bit off? Yeah. Yeah? I like that. <clears throat> okay, so we can, we can sand it now if you like. Smooth it down. Right then, let's pop that down there. Put it over your face. Jealous. He'd have loved this, wouldn't he? Mm -hmm. should do like a Saturday morning workshop, Andy, where we just bring all the children. <laughs> <laughs> Randy Quinn made boats. Oh, yeah? yeah. He's in a, a little hobby of his. He used yeah. to make boats. What, like mill pond type? <clears throat> he made a couple of cadets and then he made a yacht towards the end. Well, I would say a yacht, it's probably not a yacht, but 25 footer. Oh crikey! So, a oh, proper boat, yeah, not yeah. model boat. Oh no, 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 no sailing boats, <laughs> proper sailing boats. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He made a couple of cadet sailing boats, and because um, he had the dad was one of seven, Roll your they, used to, um, they used to go off sailing in these two boats together. All, all of them just went out in these boats. <laughs> right, Daisy, just roll your sleeves up a little bit. He also made a sidecar <laughs> for, for all seven of them once. <laughs> and there's a great well, went in it. Yeah, there's a great picture. And it was a bench seat, and they all just sat alongside, and they were all in a row. There's a great picture of Nanny on the with... road. Yeah, you'd never get away with that anymore, <laughs> would you? There's a great picture of Nanny at the back, and all of them in height order. Going <laughs> on the motorbike. Really? <laughs> <laughs> Different <laughs> times. Yes. Okay. Let me switch that fan on. Blow some of the dust away. Moving. That's it. Okay. Right then. So what we do with this, let me just show you very quickly. Right. Oh, sorry, just jump, jump down a second. We can get you a little bit closer than this. Okay. Right, what we need to do, we hold it underneath. And and we just put it on and and, it up a bit. and just move it around all the little all the little places. And just stand, stand it all down a little bit. Right, stand it towards this end of it. Hold it in your right hand and put it on the underside of it. Press really hard. You can use both hands if you like. It's really hard, Dave. Use both hands. Use both hands if you want. Okay. Push the paper it. onto the wood. Okay. Go in, into the air as well. It won't hurt you at this stage because you can push it, it's not too bad as long as you don't go near that end. That's it. And do that little flat area there. If you get the piece, you get that. Get it nice and flat there. Use the use the edge of it like that. That's it. That's it. Press hard. That's it. And then we ground it. The right round it. That's it. And round this side of it. One. If you use if you use this end, you just uh, and we roll it into a bit of a cylinder like that. 
and then you can use that. Get your, get your hand right under it and press on. That's it. And go right round it. Super smart. That looks nice, doesn't it? You feel any rough bits? No. <laughs> okay, here in the filming I'd made a real rookie error. I was turning the camera off when I should have been turning it on and on when I should have been turning it off. So you can just see the <laughs> preparations for Daisy doing the intros and outros, but I messed it up a bit, but I'll include this anyway, just for fun. You go on. That's I'm going to right. turn this old bit of wood into some fancy dog, into a fancy leg for the bed. Yeah, you're going to go this old bit of wood. Okay. Brilliant. Well, that's it. That's what we're going to do. And the problem then... is, is you do have sawdust all over your day, so. <laughs> If anyone's, if anyone's working out whether we're post edit or she's, not. She spent all day in the workshop. <laughs> <laughs> they'll, they'll be on to you. Right, so you'd say something like, well here we are, it's all finished. Yeah, believe it or not, this is the same bit of wood. <laughs> just happy just do that, just do, not the happy Christmas yet. <laughs> <laughs> just to say, well here we are, it's all finished. Believe it or not, that's the same bit of wood. And and hold it up. Brilliant. Right. Um, and do you want to do a Merry Christmas? Oh, no, no. Oh. First of all, say... Oh, yeah, we'll like do it. and subscribe. We'll, we'll do, I'll, I'll, I'll just wait. <coughs> and then we can end with... This is... This is... This has been Daisy's Cornish Creations. Have a... Lovely Christmas. Yeah. Is that alright? Yeah. So what do you say? This is been Daisy's Cornish Creations. Have a lovely Christmas. Give them a big Brilliant. smile when you say that. Okay? Good smile, Dave. <laughs> Good smile. We should have worn your gobble hat for that one. We should have your turkey hat on for the end, shouldn't we? I should have listened to you. I think we've covered everything, yeah. haven't we? Thank you, mate. That's brilliant. <laughs> well, you've done very well. She loved it. That was pretty... Yeah.